Hey guys, it's me, Speedlet Sonic, and once again, I am back for another fighting play rail video, as you guys can be able to see. I am back with the Ultimate Cross Run Brake Track, as usual. I technically never broke it down, but the reason for this video today, guys, is because, of course, I just got home from school, and um, uh, I got a new shipment of trains in, in which is pretty cool. So now we have some new challengers into the fighting play rail legacy collection, and it... Of course, um, uh, of course, did these trains um, uh, are of course of a bulk deal when I was trying to get 300 all fixed up. And as you guys can be able to see right here, I now have 300 all fixed up. Up, so now that 300 set up is properly completed, and I managed to get back 200 working again. Which of course I salvaged the motor from the 300 train to be able to use for this 300 train. As you guys can be able to see. As well, I put in some new Duracell batteries that my mom got for me me a couple weeks ago or a week or two ago. I forget when. But anyway, guys, these are the three new trains that I had gotten were uh, of uh, the numbers of 253, Urban Liner Plus, and 251. Now, of course, as well, if you guys are curious to why exactly do, is the video title off Fight and Play Royal Legacy, the gang's all here. Well, to answer that question as well, I wasn't expecting D51's last passenger car to be here until June 10th which was like a couple days after the, the Sonic Symphony in New York City, but well, nah, the, I don't want to get into that. But the reason with that being is that now I finally have D51's last passenger car. I cannot believe it that I actually that I finally have it. Well, this is more of a, a proper fill-in because, of course, I was using an A83 thing as a substitute, but at least now I have a proper fill-in for D51's last passenger car until I get the proper one. But at least until then, I now have something to use for, to fill in that slot. So now the Fighting Clearer Legacy Collection is complete. And as well with today's video, guys, I'm gonna be doing a bit of a battle royale again with these, these five trains in action to be able to show how well they run as well um, uh, maybe have them fight against some of the fighting plural trains since that all of them are now fixed up I guess I don't really know what I want to do but eh, it, at least it's of a good suggestion to what I want to do for now but anyways I'm really happy now that I have um, more of these trains fit more a uh, couple Two new train, two of my old trains fixed up, and three new ones into the battlefield, which is pretty cool. Because I've never owned a 253 Urban Liner Plus or 251 train before, but at least this is really cool to be able to know that I have these trains. As well, I organized them all by speed, so now they are. So now, of course, I always have everything organized to prevent them from crashing or from like knocking them off the track from the track from like uh, above, as you guys can be able to see. So anyways, let's get them up on the ultimate crossroad break and see what, what this um, uh, train lot can do. These guys can do. So I figured that I have this battle against the customs since that D51 was the last custom I needed to complete. Of course, if you guys haven't seen uh, 0601 Yukata's fighting clear videos, um, uh, E3, 211, D51, and Thomas all had custom additions to their trains of a drill or upper roller, a rod attacker, or a twin roller. But now, now without further ado, let's get the fight on. Oh, I did not expect, I did not see that one coming. <laughs> so it just got knocked down like it was nothing. Oh, and it looks like it's a draw between 253 and 251. Nope, never mind. Those guys are titans. <laughs> and what better way to bring back the old 200 than to have them face its fighting clear rail counterpart, as well with 100 and 0. Let's get it on and see how well these trains have gotten since their last fight, or whatever. Oh, and 100's counterparts have gone down. Oh, and 200. Uh-oh, kind of fix the get rid of you. Oh, jeez. Of course, I've got to bring in some new batteries, but I will since now, of course, with the other fighting play rail and collection hole reset, I'm going to be switching out their batteries and uh, yeah, we'll see how well those trains go from there.
And like that, the old trains have gotten their revenge. <laughs> Dang, that was pretty good. Well, I guess that's pretty much it, guys. I honestly have no idea what else I was going to do for this video. But I guess, um, uh, yeah. I honestly don't know what else I was going to do for this video because, of course, some, um, uh, as I mean, with adding the, with the addition of the newer trains and everything, I mean, I, I honestly wanted to do more, but I don't really know what else to do. I mean, I've got the ultimate cross run brake still up. I mean, I guess I could switch it over to another configuration of the cross run brake. I did do an old one of when I had D51 first introduced into the Fighting Clara Legacy Collection. That was when I had the, um, the, the wrong zero train shown on that one in, but in place of the old one. But yeah, I'm up to 29 trains beside the Fighting Player, besides the Fighting Player Legacy, and along with the other 12. I am now up to 41, I believe. I think I'm up to 41. Let me, let me check. 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 38, 39, 40, 41. Yep, 41. And once I get the other trains all fixed up, the other 16 trains, then I'll be up to 57 in trains, which is going to be a huge collection. I mean, this is just honestly nuts. I mean, this is pretty much, I mean, I did have a lot of trains during my childhood, but I'm surprised that I'm slowly getting them back. Anyways, recap. Anyways, the Fun and Clever Legacy collection is now complete. I can start being able to do more other videos, I guess. I don't really know what else I want to do, but... We'll eventually see where that goes when we when we cross that bridge and come to it. But for now, guys, I guess that's it. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to know when I upload a brand new video. Thank you all so much for watching, and I guess I will see you all next time. Bye.